So in the future, I want to use uh, Laravel, and that's a PHP framework. And if I want to use the latest version of it, I need to use a PHP version on my system that is higher than I currently have on my newly installed El Capitan uh, operating system. So if I write PHP dash dash version, I currently have version 5.5.36. So I can use brew to update this. So first we update brew itself. We do this before uh, installing anything new. Try that again. So let's resume that job. Give it to FG and the job is one. Brew update. Let's try that again. Update. Well, that seems to work. So now let's uh, update our PHP version. Brew install home brew PHP slash PHP seventy. Okay.
let's check the uh, PHP version now. And it's still the same. So what we need to do now is to point to the right PHP version. Or maybe I just have to stop my uh, Apache server, which I had running. And I go sudo apache start. So if we had any changes to the um, init file for Apache, it would probably not go into effect. So let's start it and test it again. HP dash dash version. No, that was not it. So let's uh, stop Apache again. All right, let's try to fix the path. By doing this, export path, brew, prefix, homebrew, key, blah, 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 blah. It's a temporary test. Then we go php dash dash version. And now it says uh, version seven. So let's clear. Let's open the bash rc file to um, make the path to PHP 7 permanent. So let's cd into etc. cd slash etc. And then we open Atom, the code editor. Atom, look at all files. And here we have this uh, bash rc file. So we can just add this line, I think, should do it. And save this file. And we can uh, close that. Quit. And now the change should be permanent. To make this change permanent, we need to source this file. So source slash etc slash bash rc, and it should be without the dot. So, and now the change uh, should be permanent. And we can uh, restart the computer to check it. So I'll be back after I have uh, restarted my computer. So I'm back after restarting my computer. And let's find out which version of PHP we are using. PHP dash dash version. And now it's updated to PHP 7.